Hello, um, Game of Thrones fans, and welcome back um, to Game of Thrones um, season five reviews. Yeah, welcome back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, welcome back, guys, um, to season um, five reviews. And yeah, uh, welcome to my last day three new, um, videos. The oh, high power. Yeah, it was really good, brilliant, and awesome. Jim Tom. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. And awesome. Yes. Good time. Um. Yeah. Directed by um, Mark Merlin. Written by David Beowulf. Yeah. It was a really good episode. Fantastic. Brilliant. Awesome. And great guest stars as well. Again. Um. Russell Russell did well. Yeah, it was a really good episode. Yeah, it was. Um, in Queen's Landing, of course. Um, I'll do the synopsis in a minute, guys. Yeah, coming up next will be, um, coming up next will be, um, EastEnders, then once upon a time, and then that's it for um, today. So, yeah. 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 Um, it was a really good episode, fantastic, brilliant, awesome, amazing, and wicked at the same time. Um, yeah, mm -hmm. yes, um, yeah, it was a really good episode. Yeah, it was a really good episode, and fantastic as well. Um, here's the synopsis of the show. Um, in King's Landing, um, Clarone, played by Dean Charles Chapman, and Murphy, played by, um, um, Natalie Dorman, are wed, and that, that night, they consummate their marriage in America, and then, May Matthews turn into trying to possess the Mother Seriously, played by Dean Henson, to return to Castle Rock for her well being, but she declined. Seriously, um, serious sees us um, with um, the face hound of her caring mother in law, but France Milken is powerless when she mockingly gossips about her in moving in the bedroom. Typical. In the whole house, the height. Chapter played by Ben Bennett is attacked by Lassia, um, played by Ilga Simon, uh, and Sarabra Sparrows, and forced to walk naked through the streets while they call a sinister. He requests the small council take action. The Sparrows have been their leader. The house Sparrow, played by John Fitzpriest, and um, she Cecilia meets with the house Sparrow personally to tell him that. He will not be executed that she has imprisoned the high sector. Warn him he will be placed as the head of the rat and faith. Return to the castle. Caesar has um Quinburn played by Ashley Nicola, send a message to the Lord Bathroom as the Queen Bone wipes the body of Gregory Clan Cakes on the Queen Bone's bathroom table. Mm hmm his synopsis of the North. Rick, who's played by Alfie Allen, passes through the country lad of Act Winterfall, fell, and several workers repair the castle. He's horrified to witness the several fried crossbows being hung up in the country yard. While Severn doing to Ross Mark, played by Michael Anthony and Ramsey Bolton, who's played by Ian Renan. And Reek overhears that the Bones do not have enough men to hold the North. Should the formal bannerman of House Stark rise against them, Ross tells Ramsey that the best way for them to forge an um, alliance with them is with, mar with a marriage. Yeah, with a marriage. At 
Meryl Kern, Petra, who's played by um, Angel Turner, Kelly Cassia, played by Sophie Turner, the wonderful Sophie Turner, that she has agreed to have to her wed to Ramsey. She dismisses the idea and to the woman that Ross killed her brother, Rob, to trail her family, friends, and prove her to take advantage of the certainty and use her positive action of her revenge of Bolton. After the brief delay, they continue forward to the mount and um, are seen from the Afro Burn Bruin, played by Gunnison, Gussie, and Podrick, played by Daniel Portman. God, sorry, sorry guys. Bruin tells Podrick that they will have to go around the malt, but they they already know where they will he, they will be going. While lighting the campfire, Podrick tells Bruin the story of how he became state serf to an Aston, and Bree Bruin tells him how of how she fell in love with William Bruin. She then explains that the blue stances was responsible for Bernie's death and that she had sworn to kill Stanton in revenge. Damn. Brenda and Natasha arrive at Whitefall, Winterfall, and received by Ross, his wife warned in the day by Elizabeth, both Sarah and Ramsey. Ramsey, Ramsey promises Petra that he will never hurt Natasha before Ross arrives to discuss the possible ransom of their plan. Petra tells him that with Tyrion Lanson dead, American Tyrion, um, Tyrion can win Lanson dead, American Tyrion as Queen. There uh, no reason to fear the Lanson. Ross is uncovered and shows him the letter for the Bastion from Caesar, etc. Petra reasons of the alliance, but Ross requests to leave that's been replying nervously. Oh yeah. Mm, that's how we do it. I do the small synopsis. Yeah, I do read the rest of it. Here's um, the other synopsis at the wall. Um, at the wall, stop this. Um, Stasis, played by Stefan and Dermis, with John, played by um, Kit Hamilton, who is now sitting as the Lord Command of the Night Watch. Of the Night Watch. Night Watch. John tells him that he must refuse his offer to become John Stark, the cause of offer he sworn to the Night Watchers. The Night Watch. He asked Stasius how long he intended to stay at the wall as they couldn't continue to feed his soldiers. Identify the Stasius tells John that he and his army will march on Winterfall within a fortnight. Stasius Stebbett and Davos Pe uh, Berlin come in and beg behind to ask John to have Behind to ask John to have the night watch, join them in taking Whitehall back from the Boltons, telling him that so long as the Boltons tell the North, the North will suffer, and screaming that John must might best serve the women and helping others through them. In the dining hall, John names Sharon Astra, played by Owen Tour, and Tara as the fifth, as the new first ranger. John then orders that in turn played Dominic played by Dominic Carter to debit Castle Black to become the criminal Blade Guard. A ruined fault along the wall. Then tells John that he will not go in the feeling desperate his orders and insulting him. John responds by ordering seven brothers to take Justin outside through them. Um, begs for mercy. John executes Jangling for instance, John then sees Thaddeus nodding in proof as, over, 
as he over the scene. Damn, just damn. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's really good. It's getting better and better. Um, and Brad Ross. Um, Avalon played by Maisie Williams. Watches as the man with um Dragon and High Space. Um, Tom Whistler, Whistler, uh, played by Tom Whistler, gives water to the other man who leaves to pray and other upgrades Jacqueline and um, and demands that he begin teaching her to be a this man. Jacqueline reminds her of the place Vader Dolphus, which means all men must serve. An actress that only wanted to see herself. She turns and sees that praying man has died. And two servants come to his body away, but ignore Ariel when she asks what they are doing with the body. Later, Ariel is thrown in by the wolf, Faye, played by Faye Moses, who um, asks her who is she. Ariel replies that is no one, but the wolf wraps his, his friend at with her hands and begins to beat her. Jacqueline rides and stops the fight but notice that Aaron was about to attack Ross and was needing Asus Ara um, that she became to be suffering by things owned by Aaron Stark and um, if she is needed no one Aaron then takes her business into the dock where she throws them into the war or she couldn't bring herself to the guard needed and so she hides it in Monos and among some near, nearby rocks and returns to sleep, sleeping at the house of black and white. Jacqueline then takes her to the room where she and Ralph wash dead wash a dead man's body. Yeah. Weird. Um in Vantos um rather than in Vantos Tyrion, played by Peter Dinkler Three spouses played by Colin Hill to let him debit the courage and walk in the streets in the city. The witness of this conscious breach to turn in the stage of the saber. The nearest um turn of the princess and notice Tyrion is too part of the brother. Tyrion talks to the physician and finds himself unable to bring himself to have sex with her and leaves in the while doing so. He is kidnapped by Jordan, Jordan Morton, who is played by Ian Penn, who tells him that he needs to take him to the Queen. Damn! Just damn. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. High Spell was good, really epic, and so amazing at the same time. Yeah. And um, yeah. Um, the book of this um, episode is High Spell. I'm going to give it 9.4 9.4 out of 10 because it was really good, brilliant and everything so good and a solid A because it was awesome and high fives as well and yeah subscribe, like and share guys I gave it 9.3 9.4 out of 10 and solid A plus yeah, solid A plus uh, yeah coming up next will be Eastern Sea see you at half 8 Alright guys, peace, later, subscribe, like and share on this video. Bye.